Okay, this is our morning leaving. We've been two nights at this anchorage. It's a real narrow uh, thing to get into, but we have depth in the center and it's quite beautiful. I'm inside so you can't see some for the reflection of the windshield, but uh, a truly hidden gem of a spot. Three rivers. This is a first for us, a deer is swimming across the river in front of us. And he's going mighty fast. I didn't know deer could swim that fast. Oh, well, there's two of them. Look at that. So sweet. Okay, so Terry connected with this captain about 10 minutes ago, and we could see each other on our AIS. So we knew that he was coming with this big toe. This other toe is held up and we have agreed to wait here for him to give him plenty of room to make that curve. So the commercial traffic is pretty awesome, but it comes with some degree of fear. <laughs> Just rounded the other curve from the other toe and boom, here's another toe. This is a very large stainless steel mill where I think they're taking all that scrap and melting it down and putting it into rolls of aluminum. Fascinating to watch it all work. Okay, we're just coming in our last anchorage um, before we hit Mobile Bay and it's looking to be really pretty and not as much trees and stuff hanging off the sides as our other one. So hopefully we'll have a beautiful night in here. This shows three boats of us traveling together, all in different locations in what we refer to as the oxtail. So the captain and I have taken off on a little dinghy excursion. We're trying to get some fish today. So far, we've only been trying for about 20 minutes and no bites, but- I'd like a di fish dinner tonight. <laughs> yeah, you would. <laughs> we did go online and get a three day fishing license for Alabama and we will be on the river for another three days. We're getting ready to go out to go fish. <laughs> putting our rods together. Yes. On this morning, after the 80 mile per hour winds, we managed to make our way across Mobile Bay. We followed the 
channel out and there was a lot of commercial traffic both behind us and before us. It was difficult to communicate with them and to try to stay the heck out of their way. settled in in Pensacola uh, in our spot where we're gonna leave the boat for three months and the captain is taking me out for a little date night Hi. yes we're going to dinner on a dinghy 